Hi, I'm Alejandro. And I'm Carlos. And we're the DS Twins, and welcome back to Higher Ground News. Dude, have you noticed how weird the weather has been lately? No, not really, but next time I'll be sure to check it out. You definitely should. It's been a strange month and lots of cloudy and gloomy days. In other news, we heard the Red Group had a great time at dance this week. Let's go to Eileen, who's covering this story. Hi, my name is Eileen, and I'm going to be interviewing Heidi. What school did he go to? Uh, I'm a senior at Kennedy High School. Okay, um, what do you like about um, dancing? Uh, well, I've been dancing since I was about six. So I always just like how once you get into it, you're able to like do any movement that you want and tell almost like a story uh, once you start. Some music you like dancing to? Uh, I like a lot of hip hop and since I did ballet for like six years, I do like doing like slow stuff that like has a lot of feeling to it. Okay. This I lean and back to Carlos. Wow, they truly got mad skills out there for their age. There's an interesting project that the teens worked on this week. Here's Herminia with some more details. What's your name? I'm Julia. Okay. So what are you doing here today? Um, I'm building a dunk tank for the kids. Well, so basically what it is, is um, the structure is made out of PVC pipe. So they just sit on a chair and so when hits the target, water falls down on their head. Uh, the kids get soaked, they have a lot of fun. So everybody's going to be able to use it? Everyone can use it, yes. So thank you for telling us about the dunk. You're welcome. Thank you. <laughs> Yikes, I sure wouldn't want to be dunk. Me neither. The Blue Group had a blast with a special visitor on the field this week. We're going to Mark to hear all about it. Well, this is actually the therapy dog activity, and my name is Mark Mangold, and uh, Joe Baldo uh, a couple years ago asked me to start coming down here with my dogs, and so we come here once a week and have activities with the kids. They, throw the ball for Hunter, and Dixie and Tucker, the other two dogs, sit here and get petted and played with. Wow, I wish I was there for that. Before we finish the segment, we have a special message from the yellow team who claim they won the dodgeball. We beat the dodgeball! We just want to say that they surely have amnesia because the teens clearly won without cheating. Oh, I'm getting something from the HQ. It seems like today is the first day the high ground store opens. Cool, I've heard that a lot of kids get to spend their higher ground bucks for some awesome gifts. Well. That's been the High Ground News for this week, and make sure to tune in next week for more shenanigans.